uh, when I was first asked to be the guest curator for this, I knew it would be an exciting adventure. And indeed, anything you do with J. Steve Manolis is indeed an adventure. This is kind of a visual uh, adventure uh, for sure, where um, uh, the uh, museum surveys uh, different aspects of his work, certainly put it in the best light, excuse the pun, but the best possible light um, of all the shows, and I probably curated maybe 20 or so shows here over the last 18 years. Uh, to me, this is the most exciting. It's the most vibrant. Uh, it's, it's uh, um, you know, the, the only other show I can think of was uh, the retrospective of Hunt Sloan, in which I was also the curator for. Uh, I, I picked him out a long time ago. I knew he'd be a star, and I think Stephen's going to follow in his steps, uh, st footsteps in terms of stardom. Yeah. What makes J. Stephen Manolis' artwork worthy of a solo exhibition? Well, I think, you know, um, n many critics will tell you, including myself, that to make a great abstract expressionist picture, it takes a great deal of confidence and ability. He did study uh, with uh, Wolf Kahn for over 40 years, uh, who and Wolf Kahn studied with Hans Hoffman, the great uh, uh, master uh, and teacher. And so, um, the the notion that he has put together an, a, a kind of a collection of abstract expressionist works that are on a huge museum scale. Uh, and uh, they, they, he works so hard on these that uh, the, 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 the pictures just have an exuberance to them, an energy, uh, a kind of confidence. Uh, that, that, that's really what makes these paintings sing. And I was so delighted to be involved in this. Uh, putting a show together of this magnitude uh, re requires so many details, uh, kind of daily conversations. Uh, we've planned out the show based on uh, the interior uh, specifications of the museum. So for a long time we were looking at little pictures on little <laughs> walls and now we're here so it's very exciting. Yeah, every, every turn you make, every corner you go around there is an explosion of color. Yeah, I would think so. This is the kind of show where you can be surprised at every corner. Yeah. Uh, it is a show where it uh, where you can contemplate uh, a kind of uh, spiritualism in the work. Uh, there's a great deal of depth. But I think at all of these works, there's a kind of natural visual poetry that he's been able to put together that actually uh, has a great deal of fluidity to it, uh, a great deal of movement, a great deal of depth, and all those ingredients make for a beautiful picture.